guys hope you're all doing well so I am filming this on March 8th happy International Women's Day I wear this shirt every uh, every International Women's Day um, happy International Women's Day it's gonna be belated when this video goes up but had to acknowledge it had to acknowledge it um, shout out to all of the women uh, doing the damn thing okay okay I made a haul from Shop Miss A almost a month ago. I actually made the the order on Valentine's Day. Um, Shop Miss A had a lot of delays and different things. I think they got a new man shipment. Whatever, it doesn't matter. It's here now. I forgot some of the things that I ordered. Um, and so this was kind of fun to open up. Um, I put everything in my inventory already. I didn't open up everything because um, everything is like sealed up. But I got my tweezers ready to go. And I... Um, I want to show it to you guys before I get into the haul though I didn't think it needed its own video but I wanted to share so I love makeup I collect makeup most of my makeup is for use um, to use not to use it up but to use to play with to try blah 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 however there are some things that come across come get a snack this video is gonna be long there are some things that you come across the nostalgia for the collection purposes and I think a lot of us as collectors know. So Wet n Wild released a collab with Sesame Street. Um, Sesame Street is definitely not just a millennial thing. Sesame Street has been on the air for what almost 50 years um, and who don't love Sesame Street? Shout out to, to Elmo and the crew um and they did a collab and i picked up some things because they were just so cute now wet and wild makes uh we know they make great quality products um so you ain't buying garbage but this one even if i don't ever use the palette which i am i am going to use it but like it's i'm so glad i have it and just it's just so cute um so they have an eyeshadow palette uh and <laughs> one two three sesame street okay um, like I said, shout out to Sesame Street. Sesame Street is not just a show with puppets that with bright colors and songs that make kids kids smile and laugh. It's educational. This is not a plug for Sesame Street. I am not sponsored by Sesame Street, but we gotta give we gotta represent. Sesame Street tackles some tough issues, and in the almost fifty years they've been on the air, they tackle um a lot of tough subjects from race to disabilities. Um, you know, their puppets are very diverse. You know, as far as puppets go, they, they do really well with that. And they teach kids. And we shout out because we stay in Elmo. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Big Bird and everything. Who's your favorite Sesame Street character? But anyway, here is the uh, 123 Sesame Street palette. It has some um, color in there representing your favorite monsters. Although Elmo is not straight red. He's more of like a coral. Whatever. We got beautiful green for Oscar. Um, we got the yellow for Big Bird. Cookie is a beautiful cookie blue, so cute. We'll do a we'll do a Sesame Street look. Um, and then I also picked up from the collection. They had lip stuff. They had a lot of stuff. They had uh, pencils, like chubby pencils. I got both of the face palettes because um, I just couldn't choose. I'm wearing the highlighter on one today. What are the names? So this one is a contour ish highlight. The contour is not quite my shade, but the highlighter. I'm wearing today. There's two bronzes and a highlighter. This is the Let's Play Together. Um, and this is in the shade, hold on, let me make sure. Best Buddies. And this one has Burton Ernie on the front. Uh, I am wearing that highlighter today. So, uh, cute, right? So cute. And then the other one with uh, Elmo and Big Bird on the front. This is um, two blushes and a highlighter, which all work for me. Um, this one is called Perfect Pair, and I, it's, it's so cute. And then the last thing, because I know if this is the same formula as their normal powder, their normal photo focus, we're good to go. This is their setting powder, and it's called B is for Banana, and it is a loose setting powder, and we got Big Bird. Hopefully Big Bird get us together, okay? We want our under eyes as bright as Big Bird. So I got the loose setting powder. Uh, and that's Big Bird. It's in the shade Banana. It looks like it has a little bit of peachy undertone uh, looking in here. So I don't know if it's the exact formula as the photo focus, but uh, 
We got a little Sesame Street collection. Now let's get into Shop Miss A. Had to talk about it. Shout out to Sesame Street. Those type of things bring me joy. I have, I hope Wet n Wild keeps coming out with these because I will collect. I have the um, Merry Christmas Charlie Brown one. Oh, I love this idea. I love this concept. Although things are getting high because this is, this was, well, this was $16, $15, which the big Wet n Wild palette that, oh, oh my God, gross in the litter box. The big Wet n Wild palette um, that they came out with in their normal line, that big one, I think it was $20. So anyway, and then the powder was um, six or seven dollars. And then these were like $10 a piece. So I don't know. But Sesame Street, they worth it. And that was at Walmart. So Sesame Street is worth it. Let's get into this shop, Miss A. I'm going to try to not, um, I'm going to try to go quick, but also I do what I want. So let's get into, let's get into it. Um, things are everywhere and I'm going to do my best. So a few things that aren't makeup. I'm gonna pull those out because I think I know. There's a sharpener in there somewhere, okay. I got some more bags. I got some more um, different types of bags. This is the plastic, this is for my kitchen. This is a plastic bag dispenser. We all know you grew up in a black house, you had a plastic bag full of plastic bags or a, a, a cabinet that had all the plastic bags in it. So I'm trying to be, I'm trying to level up. Um, and this is just a plastic bag dispenser. You hang it from somewhere and you put your plastic bags in and then there's just a little hole. Boop, boop. The plastic bags. Huh? It's in the home section. Try to level up a little bit. Okay. Um, I got a first aid kit. It was $1.55 and I, it was late at night when I was ordering and I was like, I think I want a super cute first aid kit. I have first aid kit. I have, I have so many band-aids. My mom works in the medical field and you know, Oh, band-aids, gauze. I, we knew where the first aid kit was before we knew where the toys were. So this comes with a big bandage in here. Uh, a big a big bandage. We got some tape, some tweezers. It looks like some scissors. Oh, damn. Some sturdy scissors. Some safety pants. Is this a sewing kit or a first aid kit? All right. For $1.55. What you want from me? But, oh my God, that's so cute. And then it comes with a nice little zip-up thing so you can refill it. That's funny. All right. I love these canvas bags from uh, Shop Miss A. Um, they are really good quality, really good for traveling, makeup, toiletries, getting on a plane, whatever. So I got a few. They were um, $1.88, $1.55 a piece. Um, $1.88 for this big one. This is the Cats. Okay. I love Cats. We know. So that's a that's a large size and then I got a few medium size I think these are medium and this is what we have I got two uh, the medium size was 155 I got two of these pink kitties because I just thought they were cute um, and then I got Gemini and then I got self-care is not selfish because I thought that one was cute. Um, but then these bags are really good. Putting things in your purse if you have a big tote. Keeping things organized. Yeah, they're really cute. And they're really heavy duty and they're canvas. You can wash them. Um, so, all right, let's get into the most random makeup situation. Everything is wrapped tight. I am not going to unwrap everything but I will oh yeah let's start here let's let's start let's start with with something there's much okay okay all right all right could I be more organized before I started this video absolutely but is that fun no um so I got a sharpener another sharpener uh we don't need to open that it was a dollar so I got a sharpener okay all right Moving along. I also got this cute mirror. This handheld mirror. Um, has a cat on it. There's a dollar and 55 cents. Cute. All right, we got it. All right, we got it. Um, cat. Then I got 
this mirror. This is the magnification mirror for precision work. Uh, this was, I don't know. Um, shop Miss A, oh, $1.88. Shop Miss A, everything is like a dollar, dollar fifty-five, dollar eighty-eight, unless you get like a bundle or something. So I'm not gonna go with prices. I'm not gonna keep naming prices. So that's what we are. This is uh, eight times magnification. So I picked that up and has a little suction. Um, so, all right. Now we're on to makeup. I'm gonna do my best. I'm gonna do my best. Okay. Already, already. Okay. <laughs> oh. All right, we'll get to the bottom of the bag. I got most of it out. All right, I'm not gonna open uh, these. I'm lying, I'm, I'm, I'm lying. I'm lying, I'm gonna open one. I want to open one. If I can open one, we're good to go. So the first thing I got was, um, I, not the first thing, but I picked up, they have some lip oils. Um, so I got, I'm getting into lip oil since I was disappointed with the D Dior lip oil. Um, this is a lip oil gloss, which I don't know what that means. But they have argan oil, um, and then they have one in, I got... Um, Cocoa butter as well, but let's open up one. I just want to see. It's clear. It's a clear gloss. Um, I I couldn't tell you right now if they're oily or whatever, but I picked up those two. Pick those up. Cool. All right. There's some other lip oils in the bottom of my bag somewhere, but we're not going to get into that. They have this line of dreamy lipsticks. They are a dollar a piece. Um, they have like bundles and stuff, but a lot of them were sold out. So I only picked up two shades because um, I didn't know how I was going to feel about them. So I have, I have two shades here. Uh, let me get them open. <laughs> I will say, y'all, Shop Miss A, um stuff is packaged well because they also have a store I think it's in Texas they have a storefront and um yeah everything's sealed well so like okay so these are the dreamy lipsticks here it's giving matte powder kiss it's giving matte powder kiss so I have the shade cuddles and we'll swatch cuddles Um, it's a very light, um, I wouldn't say sheer, but soft. That's Cuddles. And then we have, this is pretty, we have Flirt. Yeah, they're like a soft, I don't want to give them Powder Kiss, because they're not like that velvet matte. They have a little sheen to them, but they're very soft like the Powder Kiss. Huh. Interesting. Okay, I grabbed a mascara. I'm not going to open this yet. This is their Big Boss Mascara in black. It says volume plus length. So we have a mascara here. Not going to open that right now. Not going to open that. I do have some fun things I am going to open. Okay, so they have foundation sticks. Hold on. I might as well. The bag's almost empty. I'm doing, I'm doing okay. I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be okay. All right, so we'll swatch one. They have foundation sticks, um, and I picked up three. I actually bought four, but one was sold out because it's hard with like these more inexpensive brands, like the swatches. Are we sure they're going to look like what they say they're going to look like? So I picked up four foundation sticks, um, and this is what they look like. They are like a, like a chubby balm size, and that's what you get. And this shade is called, um, this is the deepest of the three. And this shade is called Rich. Um, so I'll swatch Rich. That's way too dark for me, but that'll be good for contour, I guess. So that gives me some hope. So that's Rich there. And then the other two are uh, Amber and Cappuccino. I'll just show you the tops of them. And then Rich. So, yeah, so 
Little stick foundation. Little stick foundation. Um, they have... We'll do the eye stuff in a moment. We'll do the eye stuff in a moment. In a moment. In a moment. In a moment. Um, I picked up two more lip oils from their Cherry Blossom line. Um, this one is, they look different. One's in a, a circular cylindrical tube and one's in a square tube. This is the Avocado Lip Oil and then the Jojoba Lip Oil. And they're from their Cherry Blossom line. Um, so. So, yeah. Show you that. Um... I picked up some gel liners. I'm not gonna open. I'm gonna open one. I'm gonna open one and swatch, see if it's soft. I'm gonna open one, but then I'll just show you the others. So they have some gel liners which are a dollar, um, and I picked up some shades. This shade is called Sand Dollar. Oh, that's creamy. All right, that's good. That's creamy. It's like a nude. That's Sand Dollar. Um, so the other shades I picked up, and I'll just show you the ends of them. We have Cool Days, which is this seafoam teal. Cool Days. Uh, then we have, oh my god, Jelly Bean. Jellyfish. Jellyfish is this like peachy one, peachy pink. Uh, yeah, we don't have time to open them all up. We got a purple. We have a fuchsia. And we have a black. The purple is called Starfish. The fuchsia is Beach Babe. And the black is Seize the Day. Seize spelled S-E-A-S. -E so these are the other three. Everything is fully sealed up. So, um, yeah. All right. Okay. I got a contour stick. I... I got a contour stick. It's the a -way Studio contour stick in the shade uh, Spice. Um, I think one of these was sold out as well. Like in my order, like I ordered it and then they let me know that they had to refund me for it. Uh, it was one of these and definitely one of the foundation sticks, I believe. So, this is in the packaging of like a jumbo eye pencil or jumbo lip pencil type of packaging and I'm trying to open it all right yeah this is a contour stick shade spice that's warm more like a bronzer that'll work as bronzer for me okay Cool, 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 cool. All right, I got these Big Boss Balms. I got two of them. I got the mango because I love mango and watermelon because I love watermelon. So these are advertisers for lips, hands, and body. And it's this big balm. I was always honestly expecting it to be even bigger than this. I'm going to open the mango. Um, it says for all skin types and it says it hydrates. It's $1.55. I smell mango now. Um, okay. That's like... Oh, that feels good. You know what it feels like? It feels like petroleum jelly. That's what it feels like. Although I heard Vaseline makes a jumbo stick. Anyway, that's what it feels like. It does smell like mango. Um, it feels just like Vaseline to me. All right, I also picked up, not going to open this yet, but their AOA Pro line. AOA Studio versus AOA Pro. AOA Studio, AOA is their in-house brand. This is their Silky Lash Boost Serum. I'm going to I'm gonna give this a try. I'm going to start using it nightly or daily. What does it say do? Whatever it says do. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to try. I want to try one. I also picked up their Tacky Base Glitter Adhesive. So this is glitter adhesive. I'll let you know how it goes. Don't need to open that right now. Don't need to open that. Um, they have a new line of loose powders. This one's called the Puffin Set. Uh, I remember their original AOA Studio line having 
um, having loose powders. Did they just rebrand them? I don't know, but I bought it. Puff and Set, and it's in the shade Banana. So, what am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. So, now, we're, we're getting there. I ordered, they have these new Wonder Glitz Glitter Gel Toppers. I didn't even open the pack. I bought the bundle. The bundle was like $7. There's five shades. Let's open this together. Um, oh, God. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so Wonder Glitz Glitter Gel Topper. You Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I love things in jars. So, whoa, look at that one. I didn't even really, I didn't even open it. Look at that one. I don't want to get glitter everywhere. So that one's called Radiant. I don't think there's a lot in here though. Let me, let me open one because it doesn't look like there's a lot in here at all. I mean, for a dollar and some change, they're only a dollar and 55 cents. So, literally. So, I'm not going to expect too much. But these are glass jars. They're not plastic. They're glass jars. Um, how much does it say you get? It doesn't say. Oh, they're sealed up. I'm not going to uns... Okay, I'll unseal. Oh. It's beautiful. A dollar and fifty-five cents. So, like, if they do well... Oh, they're thick. They're not bad thick. Let me just swatch this one since we have it here. If these do well, like, if these are good, um, I'm going to want all the shades. Oh, yeah. I'm going to want all the shades. That's beautiful. Look at that. I'm going to want all the shades. I want, well, I have all the shades. I'm going to want them to come out with a million shades because these are things in jars for $1.55. So let me just show you in the jar. That was Radiant. This one is um, Vivid. Focus. Focus. There we go. Vivid. This one's beautiful. This one is um, Silk. Then we have Starlight. And then finally, oh, that's beautiful. There's huge chunks in it. Uh, this one's called Moon Glow. I mean, I mean, I need to make my own glitter gels. I need to fit, uh, start that project back up again where I'm trying to finesse that recipe. Um, because I love shit in jars. Oh, that's really stuck on my hand here. So I'm trying to wipe this off. And that's really, it's doing pretty good. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. All right. So, let's go on to eyes and I have some face things. Um, I picked up, I'm not going to swatch these, but aren't they giving uh, elf bite size? Except these are the AOA Studio, I'm going to show you, the AOA Studio, um, oh my god, when the plastic sticks to everything. These are the AOA Studio, <laughs> oh god, whatever, uh, Sunday afternoon eyeshadow quads. It's the exact same size as the Elf Bite size. Elf Bite size is $3. These are 5 I mean, these are $1. I'm sorry, $1. I picked up just two of them that I thought might work good for me. Uh, this one is called Fuzzy Blanket. So I picked this one up. And then this other one is a little bit, got a little bit something something because this one's called Movie Time. And movie time in a quad. Oh my god. In a quad, we have a glitter. 
Look at that. Had to get it. Had to get it. So we got those a dollar a piece. And then they have this cherry blossom line as I talked about. Um, I am going to try to move quickly here. But y'all, y'all here with me. Y'all here with me. So this cherry blossom line, I think that's their new, that's their, it's been out for a while though. Uh, I, I'm going to tie it to spring. Um, you know, it's been out though. And I'm going to unwrap these four. If the plastic didn't stick to my hand as I'm trying to throw it away, you know, that would make things go a little bit smoother. But anyway, they have these adorable. Um, if you guys have been watching me, you know I've been obsessed with smaller palettes, specifically like drugstore, drugstore quads and stuff. Oh my God. So <laughs> these, I am fighting with the plastic. These are not quads. They're actually eight pan shades, but they are smaller than a lot of quads. Um, and I just thought they were so cute. All right. So these are the Cherry Blossom eyeshadow palettes. Eight colors. Uh, let's, let's do it. This is Shut Sugar. Look. First off, the packaging. The packaging. Let's get into how beautiful that is. That's beautiful. We want to swatch. I can barely get my big fingers in here. Oh, that is shut sugar. So cute. This is about the size of a powder compact or a blush. Uh, maybe a just just so cute. All right, this one's called. Ochado, 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 Ochado. Okay, it's a softer one. I was not gonna get all four, and I was like, I was, I was like, these are adorable. I, I, this is Hana, H A N A. Look at that. Look at the depth in that one. How cute are these tiny little things? And then we have um, Lotus. So pretty. So pretty. Okay, and then the rest of the eyeshadow. Are these individually wrapped as well? Because I don't have time. They have um, what are called, I don't, this is like a butterfly, fly with me. Um, and they have singles. They have a matte. They have 12 singles. And they have they've separated them between mattes and I don't want to say shimmers, maybe metallics. I think. Um, and I just bought all, all of them. They they had like options for two bundles. Um, and I bought all of them. So they're called Fly Away. Fly Me Away. Yeah, they're individually wrapped as well. We're not going through this. Uh, Fly With Me eyeshadows. So I'm just going to show them to you. Uh, this is the deepest one here. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not looking at all these right now. All right. Looks like the deepest one here is this shade called Transform. It's like a deep matte brown there. God damn it. I opened one. I opened the deepest one. They are sealed up, baby. And I appreciate it. I really, really do. Um, yeah, like I said, should I have all this ready before I turn the camera on? I was excited. Um, what are you gonna do? Fast forward, watch me on two times speed. That's what I do. All right, this one's called Transform. So they're cute little compact little singles. When's the last time we got a single eyeshadow like this in a compact? Damn. All right. Um, so we have some various neutrals. They're all in the neutral family. Um, this one appears to be the lightest shade. Oh, that one's, this bundle's super taped up. But we have the lightest shade here. And then, yeah, I'll get into them. Another time. And then finally, we have two blushes. Oh, back to that cherry blossom line. Um, back to that cherry blossom blossom line. They have four, they have four blushes that they um 
released with this line in these square pans. I'm going to open this up. They are really cute. I got the two uh, deepest, deepest ones. Boy, oh boy, the plastic. It's a lot. I appreciate it because it's sealed, but it's also just an immense amount of plastic. <laughs> Can't be good. Can't be good. All right. So this first one is called uh, Euro Kobe. Euro Kobe or Euro Kobe. And so it's in this beautiful, beautiful cherry blossom packaging. And that's what it looks like. That one might be a little light for me. Mm, neutral. Mm -hmm. And then this one is called Raku. And that's a beautiful shade. A beautiful. Oh, that's pretty. It's like a brick. That is pretty. Swatch that. Oh, that's soft too. Oh, yeah. Oh, I like that. Oh, that's pretty. Wonderful. And then last but not least, we have in this haul, we did it. We have highlighters. Um, uh, yeah, so there was two lines of highlighters. These are really pretty. These are called the Everglow highlighters. There was only three shades of them. Um, and I got all three because they were a dollar and fifty eighty-eight cents. I'm gonna tell you something now. I think all of them are probably light. Based on what I remember. If I remember, if my memory is serving me correctly, I think. Let's see. Am I gonna break it? Alright, I gotta like I think if you wet the plastic it won't be it won't be sticky anymore. It won't be staticky. Oh yeah, that works. That works. Sorry you guys. I just solved my problem and I'm excited. Okay. Alright. So this one is called Twilight. I think Twilight might be the deepest one. Okay, let's see if we can open it. So here's the packaging. Twilight is definitely not the deepest one. Let's swatch it. Oh, it's a highlighter though. This one, it is a highlighter. Oh, it's icy. This one's icy. Wow, it's pretty. I don't know if that's going to work for me, but that's definitely... That's a highlighter already. Um, yeah, I... I think I might be right in all these being light. This next shade is called Magic Hour. Is it the Magic Hour? Let's see. I don't. God damn it. What's wrong with me? This one is Magic Hour. Okay, that's a pinkier one. All right, let's get into the to the last one of these three. It only came in three shades. Let's get into the last one. Plastic off, do we? Okay. All right, cool. This one's called Morning Star. I didn't get all the I didn't get all the plastic off. Griff is going to have a field day tonight. He loves chewing on plastic. Um, am I tripping? This won't open. Ah, there. Oh, my God. It was worth the struggle. Look at this peachy, goldeny goodness. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at that. It's 
Peachy go. Oh. 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 That's gorgeous. Oh my goodness, that's Morning Star. That's lovely. And then the last thing, I have a little bit more highlighters. I got, um, these are their Glow Within Illuminating Powders. And I bought the bundle. There's five in here. I bought the bundle. Um, and these, oh my god, they're wrapped in plastic too. I'm, I, I, I can't. I literally can't. This video, are they wrapped in plastic? I can't tell. Yes, they're wrapped in plastic. I'm just going to show them to you. This one's called Wish on a Star. Say white, yellow, I won't know until I swatch later. This one's called um, Kawaii. Uh, this one is called, I, I might open one, I'll, I'll open one. This one's called Do No Harm, Do spelled Do, D-E-W. I'll open that one. This one's called Brunch Date. And then this one's called Hopeless Romantic. Illuminator. So I'm curious. Now I gotta open two. God damn it. So I'm opening up Hopeless Romantic. Oh, that wasn't that bad. There's only a yellow thing around. I mean, only a plastic like ring. It's not over the whole thing. So this hopeless romantic. Look at this. What is this? It's a highlighter. It's or it could be blush. That's beautiful. Look at the sheen on. Look at that. Wow. So that's hopeless romantic. And then I will swatch one more because it's time for bed. It's it's time for bed. This is uh do no harm. Do no harm. Oh. Oh, we love to see a gold like that. We love a gold. We got highlighters in here, baby. Shot Miss A. Okay. So that is my gigantic Shot Miss A, Miss A haul where I forgot some of the things that I got. But I'm really happy and really excited about all of them. Um... Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, comments, concerns about any of the products mentioned in this video, feel free to leave it down below. Don't forget to tell me your favorite Sesame Street character. Um, I love you all and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.